Hello, it is me, the Wombat. How are you guys doing? Happy Vlogmas Day number seven! I still got like that weird throat thing. <coughs> there we go. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, how's everybody doing? It's kind of later in the day. I am leaving the parking lot of the dental school. The dental school is a very nice place to get some teeth work done. If you got some bad teeth like yours truly. And the young kids are very nervous and very delicate because they don't want to hurt you and get bad grades. So I got that going for me. I, I've got some bad dental stories. I mean, I've had, oh man. I had my wisdom teeth taken out when I was 21. They did the bottom ones first because they actually came in almost at a perfect 45. And then they got holes in them and then they got broken. This isn't really a Vlogmas video. This is more of a dental video. So, anyways, I had my wisdom teeth taken out because they're causing me like incredible pain. They'd actually breach the surface and there's quite a bit showing not the whole tooth wasn't all the way through but I had caps kind of like about the size you take like a, a paper mate pin and you you look at like the inside that goes in there it was about that big and I had stuff that had gotten in there and oh man it was killing I got the day off work as an emergency thing and went and the oral surgeon that was supposed to be there called in sick so the dentist says you know I can try to pull him. I said, they're killing me, just pull him. So he got this thing, looks like a big handled ice pick, and <clears throat> and the one, the first one that came out, I don't remember now if it's left or right, doesn't matter, but the one, it's like they actually dropped the tooth, and I almost just swallowed it, and that was, yeah. And then the, then the other one, the guy's prying and prying and prying, I hear, kick, kick, kick. And I'm like thinking, okay, the tooth's breaking or something. Wrong. Chunk of jawbone. The roots had hooked around it. And actually, nice little, probably quarter by quarter, like quarter of an inch by quarter of an inch chunk of bone. The roots had grown around. So it, it broke loose. So it was like... Yeah, it was, it was a lot of pain. And then the upper ones, they tried to breach, then grew over. That was like about three or four times. Finally had those cut out. That was no fun. When I was a kid, I've had dentist drop tools, poke you in the gum with a little hooky probe thing, poke you in the tongue, have my tongue bleed a couple times. So, yeah, got poked in the tongue a few times. Had one dentist that I I swear he was he was uh, using his feet to do the work because it was pretty clumsy dude and he had massive hands. And my mouth isn't that big. You might think the wombat is a big mouth because he talks a lot, but the actual physical size of my mouth, not too good. So, and then that guy, he, he gave me a bunch of shots of Novocaine, but it was just like, it, I swear it was in the wrong spot because it wasn't effective at all. And then he was just riding that nerve. Man, I thought it was going to come unglued. He's like, what, what, what's wrong, what's wrong? I go, oh, of course you can't talk at the dentist when they're asking you what's wrong. You got all this crap in your mouth and suction and hoses and everything. and. Uh, what's wrong and I probably put permanent imprints into the handles of that thing I was just like so needless to say those are just a couple I've almost every time I've been to the dentist it's been horrible so my teeth are paying the price and I'm paying the price too dental school good place to go it's cheap like I said the kids are great they take their time they're 
super thorough it takes a long time to get anything done because they're that thorough but it's you know it's good they're learning I'm getting my stuff done about, about half the price what it normally costs some things were actually a lot less than half the price I had three teeth had an estimate done one was like five or six maybe it was about I think it was like five or six thousand and then it was like up to seven a little bit over seven almost eight and I was just like you know what at this point I'm just gonna drive down to TJ pay somebody a couple hundred bucks pull out all my teeth because I could get some nice straight dentures for probably about seven or eight thousand dollars versus having three teeth that are just gonna go bad pretty soon fixed but you know I went to a few places actually with the idea of just because I've had multiple root canals and almost every single tooth in my head has been filled at least more than twice like I said I got some bad teeth and I did say teeth but yeah it's it is what it is I guess it was all right for my parents because they didn't have to since I didn't like the dentist they could push it off but now as an adult Wombat's got to pay the ticket got to pay the price more ways than one so that's just my my lovely dental vlog for today happy dental vlogmas day I will put together a more happier video sometime this evening at least that's the plan but just leaving the dentist and you know they put the they put the they what they did today was I had a couple teeth filled one actually had a root canal done on it and I've had the temporary crowns on for a while and with the kennel cough I was putting off going back for a bit and this cough has been hanging on for a long time so I finally went back feeling well enough today to go back um, they checked the ones that they're gonna make the permanent crowns out of the whatever metal they make them out of plus porcelain they had to size them to know how much porcelain they could put on there I told them just leave a metal I mean I thought I looked like the Terminator and that'd be really cool but the the, the girl she just kind of laughed nervously like I don't know if she thought it was funny if she thought I was joking if she thought I was serious or if she thought I just lost my mind I she just politely laughed I said no no it's alright I'm just I'm just messing with you so they were that was just getting them the old ones taken off and the new ones put on to size and everything and stuff that was probably three hours maybe like I said they're very thorough and then to put the temps back on then they use a the floss to make sure they they fit nicely and then you do the thing with the colored film the tap 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 side to side grind 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 and they look they do that with that blue um, paper that looks like paper out of like a the old um, pages they used to have years ago where you'd have like three sheets and they'd have like a piece of carbon film between it it looks like it's kind of that stuff makes blue marks on your teeth and then they just check everything out and they go from there but everything's fine I'm back in commission never was really out of commission just took some time off to have that stuff done one of the guys at work he needed some stuff done so he's been going to the dental school too and we, so we gotta kinda orchestrate how all that works out between the two of us taking time off because like I said it does take longer than planned so you you know when you go to the dental school it's like you gotta plan on taking the whole day pretty much or at least half the day <coughs> to get stuff done and like I said they are pretty cheap so and I've said that a bunch of times but I'll, I'll put some You'll see some images that'll be sprinkled through here of some of the lovely 
tools that they use to do what they do because they do what they do because that's what they do or something like that so I'm just kind of driving assessing the freeway situation and it looks like everybody's going about five miles an hour so it looks like the wombat is going home on surface streets I don't go subterranean anymore can't do that but um, I can drive on surface streets just takes a little bit more maneuvering and, and different things so we shall do that we shall definitely do that so like I said I will have better stuff for you coming up shortly and I'm just gotta find my way home so isn't there a song by some band something about can't find my way home or something something like that I feel a cough coming on so I will see you guys later bye